Greetings, people of Earth, and welcome to a brand new series on what used to be the Mage Wars series. Uh, so yeah, I still have a lot more episodes to come out of that that are pre-recorded, so don't worry, there will be more episodes of that, but it will be ending in about 15 episodes or so, so look out for that. But this is Pixelmon. Yep, as you can see, I can throw my Pokeball. Go, Trico, I choose you! And I have Trico with his little cute horns and his tail of doom. And that's him, and he's adorable, and he is my friend. And if I press G, I can make ch make him forage in the ground, which is kind of cool. But, uh, yeah, so I have a whole bunch of stuff to show you guys, and this is the server, so Gabriel will be on here. Hopefully my little brothers will get on here sometimes. Uh, maybe Jerome will get on if he gets a new computer. But this guy's name is Theodore Six Eyes, and I'm in a village right now. The Pokedex says Cubone's mother died, but if every Cubone's mother died, that math doesn't add up at all. No, it doesn't, my friend. You are the smartest person I know. Trico, you're adorable. We're just going to have him out and follow me around, because why not? Wait, what are you? I'm part of the canine section. I really like my Houndor. Chasing burglars, sniffing out dangerous stuff. She does it all. That's nice, Deputy Lenny. That's nice. Ooh, what are you? You're Starmie, I think. I know Pokemon, guys. I definitely... <gasps> Ponita! Wow, you're level 28, and my guy's level 9, and grass and fire, and I would get destroyed. So let me show you guys something. Um, Cheaty Town. So I log on the server, I explore for a bit, I find this big plains biome, I'm like, oh yay, Pokemon stuff will spawn here, right? Well, something did spawn on that's over there that I'll show you in a second. But I make this, right? Which I think is pretty good, right? This is all built. I built this all in creative. You know, I put some guys in here, because you know there's always guys that are in the Pokemon Center. And I put a trade machine in here, and I put a healer, and there's a doctor guy who will heal your Pokemon for you. With a microwave, apparently. And then I make the park, made the Pokemart with this guy who will sell you and buy stuff and all that. And then, and then I'm like, alright, cool, so I found that, let's, you know, let's keep exploring a little bit. So I'm like, let's go this way, because I see more planes, right? So I'm like, do-do-do, you know, going over here. Actually, no, that's not true, I saw the mountain. I wanted to make my home in the mountain. So I start going over this way, right? I'm like, hey, this is great. Ten out of ten, great mate, right? Chop down trees for the house. You know, I'm walking around, I see this uh, apricorn tree around here. Ooh, a weeping bell. Okay. And I'm like, oh, look, an apricorn tree. So I start walking that direction. And then I see that. And I'm like, whoa, what the crap is that? And then I'm like, oh, there's a village there. And then I'm like, oh, it has blue houses. Oh, it has a Pokemart. Oh, I didn't need to build Cheaty Town at all. <sighs> also, this is really cool. It takes a long time to break. But these are basically coal deposits of coal ore. So what happens is when it takes its three years to break... It just spits out a coal, and then I can keep doing that. I don't know how long they last, but they are a thing. So, yeah. And then this is the village with the whole bunch of people, and there's the Pokemart in here. <gasps> I just realized that this is a dark oak sapling. Guys, I'm really sorry, but I'm going to need to steal that. Um, Here, you can have that one. It's much prettier, I promise. Yeah, so we can sell stuff, buy stuff. Um, just like you can in the games. And, uh, I got this sharp beak. I don't know what it does. Forgive me, I'm a Pokemon noob. I mean, I've played, uh, I played Emerald. Never beat it, because I was little. What are you? Surprise to sailor here. Sailor here? I'm on shore leave. So tonight, I'm eating with my family. I hope they won't cook spinach. I hate spinach. Hey, Popeye reference. Good job. So then I, uh, I come over here, right, and I talk to everybody, and I'm like, this is awesome. This is why I wanted to play this mod. There's nothing in this chest, by the way, but this doctor guy can heal your Pokemon just like the one I cheated in. And then I see this thing, and I'm like, oh, hey, look. Awesome. A place of justice. And I go in the chest, and there's amazing things. So yeah, now we have amazing things. And I had a whole bunch of apricorns, which, excuse me, I have the hiccups. If you guys don't know Pokemon at all... The apricorns are basically what they use to make Pokeballs. And, um, I got a bunch, so I planted them right over here. And as you can see, they're already growing. 
So this is what they look like when they're tiny little baby trees. Then they grow up. Whoa. Do you guys see that like little sliver of green right there? Like a leaf or something? I don't know. Then they grow like this. Then they grow like this. Then they grow like this. And then they get a flower. And then finally they get a little red fruit on the top. And if we look up. Apricorn? Yes. Uh, so you take these. And then you, you can make furniture out of them for some reason. But you also cook them. And then you can turn them into uh, lids. Or sorry. Discs. For Pokeballs. Yeah. And then once you've done that. Sorry, I'm just looking through all these. Uh, no, 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 no. <gasps> I heard a Magikarp. Did you guys hear that? That was adorable. Where are you? I want to murder you. So I can... There you are. Hi. So I throw my Pokeball at it. And then... Oh, hey, look. The fruit grew. Fight. Pound the crap out of this Magikarp. Use Splash. Good job, Magikarp. Yes. Continue to pound the crap out of him. More pounding. Magikarp. Pound him. This is starting to sound wrong. Beat the crap out of the magic card. Oh, cool. I got two clownfish. I guess I can do stuff with that. So if I pick this fruit, I get a red apricorn, which I can then smelt into this, and then I can make that into Pokeball discs. So I have red apricorns growing here. I believe these are... Oh, black apricorn, yellow apricorn, blue apricorn, bl whoa. Whoa there. White apricorn, blue apricorn, pink apricorn, another pink apricorn, and these three are green. So I have a little variety garden over here. Uh, so we can't make any Pokeballs just yet. Also, dark oak sapling. Hype, 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 hype. Because that's my favorite tree in the game. So I'm going to start growing some of that. See if I can't get that to repopulate the world. Um, ooh, what kind of apricorn are you? Also, uh, Tinker's Construct is a thing. So I have Pam's Harvest Craft, but it's broken. For whatever reason, this version of Pam's Harvest Craft is broke. So I can't, we just can't use that. White Apricorn, cool. Uh, yeah, so it is on difficulty peaceful because this is not focused around vanilla. <gasps> yeah, I was hoping to find one of these to show off in this little trailer thing. Pokey Loot. You can see it by these sparkles that come off it. Oh my gosh. TM35 Flamethrower. That is an amazing TM. But since my starter is this adorable little glorious little uh, lizard thing. Tree gecko, sorry. Harvest that block for me. Can you not reach it? Are you a failure? Move. Okay, I can't move you. Harvest that block. Did you harvest it and nothing happened? Okay, you're useless to me, Trico. I'm kidding, I love you. Alright, let's do this. Let's go... So Zubats come out at night. I don't see any at the moment, but they do come out. What is this? Ooh, Waterstone Ore. That's like super rare, I think. Not certain, but I'm pretty sure that's really rare and useful. Especially for a certain Pokemon, who I happen to know Gabriel will be picking. Uh, yeah, so... You know, pretty standard mod pack. A lot lighter than, um... Let's do this. A lot lighter than... Mage Wars was. For the main reason that this mod pack is focused around Pixelmon, and Pixelmon takes a whole lot of, uh... Sviper? You are terrifying looking, but I love you. Wow. Look at the animation on that. It looks so, like, slithery and cool. Trico, Trico, I'm gonna have you come back in your ball because I'm worried that thing will bite you. Uh, yeah. So, we can go in here and talk to Dr. John, I believe it is. Nurse John, just let me heal those Pokemon for you. Thanks for healing me with a microwave. Don't know how safe that is for my beautiful, glorious Pokemon, but thank you. Level 22 Drifloom. Nope, don't want to mess with it. <gasps> Ooh, what are you? Ooh, uh, Ultra Chest. So this is like the Poke Loot, but it looks like this instead of, um, that. Poke Loot for the win! Yeah. Um, Ice. Ice. Ice's Golden Hourglass? 
I'm gonna look that up. Give me one second. Let's see. Uh, come on. Poke uh, no. Uh, Pixelmon. EC's golden hourglass. Yep. Yeah. What are you? Uh. EC's Golden Hourglass is a single-use item that can be used on a ranch block to cause all Pokemon that are currently engaging in the breed process to advance one stage of affection. It will not affect Pokemon that are unsatisfied with their environment and can be attained as a Tier 2 special drop. The Hourglass's namesake, EC, is one of Poke Pixelmon's administrators. Cool! So, I don't think we're going to be needing to do Pokemon breeding anytime soon. So I think we're just going to go ahead and see how much it would sell for. We might not sell it, depending on how valuable or not valuable it is. But, you know, if it fetches a pretty penny, we might we might go ahead and sell it. Uh, let's see. Yes, sell. Wow! That sells for an incredible amount. I might sell flamethrower, not going to lie. Can I not sell this thing? Nope. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to keep it. Guys, what do you think? If I sell flamethrower, I could buy a whole bunch of balls. And I can... I don't want to buy any mail. Screw off. Um, I could buy, like, a couple revives, some potions. I think we're going to have to do it, guys. Sell flamethrower. I did it. There it was. I did it. Also, shirt beak. I, I'm going to guess... Now, I might be wrong, but I'm going to guess that boosts the power of flying-type moves. That would make sense to me. Okay, let's buy a Great Ball. There it is, our first Great Ball of the series. Mm, nah, let's buy, like, four Pokeballs. And that should be enough to get us started on our Poke journey, as it were. Let's go try to catch something. And I guess I don't really need this food, huh, since I put it on Peaceful. Alright, so I have one Great Ball, so I could YOLO it on a decently strong Pokemon and hope it catches. I know the, uh, the chance of catching is pretty darn high, uh, maybe a little bit higher than it should be, but we're gonna, we're gonna see. Um, oh, the, the deputy guy got out, good. Or he died, one or the other. I'm gonna hope he got out. Because I'm a nice person. Um, give me one second here. Video settings. We're gonna drop that frame rate just so it's a little smoother for you guys. Yeah, there you go. Um, you could be very useful. Level 43 slow, bro. I don't think I can catch that. Mm, yeah, no. Don't. Definitely don't think I could catch that. There's a lot of Pokemon in the- ooh, a green po uh, apricorn thing. Gimme. Okay, my inventory's getting full. I need to go drop some stuff off. But Pokemans need to be captured. Let's see. Come on. Let me find something cool. And then I will be happy. I wanna find something... What kind of apricorn are you? Because if you're a black apricorn, then I will happily accept you because I need black apricorns. Uh, I don't need you, brown wool. What kind of apricorn are you? Red. I need that. Give me the red apricorn. Did I already get it? Yeah, I already got it. Okay. Yellow apricorn, don't really need that at the moment. There's Cheaty Town over there. A Zubat. Let's try to get a Zubat. Actually, they're kind of trash. Let's maybe not. Let's go into this plains over here and see what we can find. I wish that Seviper was still there. Also, wait, what? I just heard a Pokemon say something. I heard you. Don't hide from me now. Camera's out. What is this? Oh, lava. Hello, lava. And some iron. 
Alright. Ooh, there's more lava. There's another green one. We'll be able to make dusk balls. Dusk balls, sorry, without too much worry. I wish there was some kind of an animation when you picked an apricorn so that you knew you picked it. Uh, what are you? Whoa. String, I don't want you. A litwick! He's lit, fam. What is that over there? What are you? Oh, you're a skitty. I don't care about you. Oh, that's too bad. What level are you? 13? Yo, you really want to fight me. I just heard a charbok. I mean an arbok. They say charbok. Oh, it's Eakins. Litwick. I want you. Come here. That was totally on you. Trico, stop failing at life. Come on. No. Litwick? There we go. Okay. He's a level 22. Great ball. YOLO mode. Please capture him. Oh, that looks so cool. The animation, though. Waiting. If we hear a microwave ding. Oh, nope. He broke free and almost one-shot my dude. Um... Let's try a Pokeball, and if this doesn't work, then we're dead. Catch it? Nope, nope, he's dead. Definitely dead. He used Flame Burst on my poor tiny little Trico. Okay. Well, there goes our- wow! Oh, it looked like it was like a super evolved form of guy that had like four wings or something. No, I wanted to catch that thing. Okay, Nurse John, heal my Pokemon. Thanks for microwaving my Pokemon, bro. Um, so I want to catch some kind of Pokemon that I can fly on. Level 10 Centret, you'll make a good friend. For Trico. We're gonna pound you. That'll make you our friend, right? What if I absorb? Can I absorb you? Oh yeah, that's really good. Oh my! He got a critical hit! That's not fair. You're not allowed to do that, stupid thing. Nurse John! Whoa, you're a level 42 trainer. I don't want none of that. Nurse John, microwave my Pokemon some more. They weren't quite done last time. Thank you for microwaving my Pokemon. Uh, send thingy, um... Ooh, a little Starmie babies. Aw, you guys are actually adorable. Oh, you sound so cute! Let me murder you! Wait, you have quick attack? That could actually be really useful. It's not very effective. One more. <sighs> yes. Okay, he's in the red. This is how you play the game. I'm aware of how you play Pokemon. Pokeball. Come on, go into the Pokeball. And one rock, two rocks, three rocks. We did it! We caught our first Pokemon, guys. So now if we press down on our little uh, number pad over here, we can switch to Starly. Oh, you are the most adorable little thing ever. And I, I can't ride on you, right? Yeah, no, okay, I didn't think so. That would be very strange if I could. What was that? I'm gonna watch that back in editing, because I really want to know what that thing was that I just saw. Um, but yeah, guys, we're gonna have Nurse John microwave our brand new Starly, who is super weak, but that's okay, because we can train him. Uh, he has, let's see, if we go here, we can click on him. Summary. Experience zero, level up 57. Flying and normal, status okay. Ability keen eye, prevents other Pokemon from lowering accuracy. Cool, moves, quick attack, growl, and tackle. That's, uh, quick attack is pretty nice that uh, he has that instantly. Uh, stats, uh, ooh, ooh, this is bad. Nature relaxed, we don't want that. He has minus speed and plus defense. That's not good for a Starly, but we'll take him as our first ever caught Pokemon. And the most adorable... He's gonna be our pet, you know? He's not gonna be our fighting Pokemon. He's gonna be our adorable little mascot for the series. 
And if we have him forage on the grass, he gives us nothing. So everyone, uh, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, make sure to subscribe and hit the like button. What do you have to say to that, Starly? Starly, you were just making noises. Don't do this to me. We They should all subscribe, right, Starly? Look at him, he's nodding his head. No. Yeah, he thinks so too. Okay, this has been the most awkward and cringy outro ever. I hope you all enjoy. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna play Pokemon. Oh, yeah, also these boots are dark boots. I got them because they were in the blacksmith chest also. Let's go, Starly! Whatcha? That model looks awesome for when the Pokeball is in the air. It's a little bit jittery, but it's it's still cool. Starly, come here. Come here, Starly. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, Starly. Come here. Starly. Starly? Come here. They're supposed to follow you. Starly! You little piece of garbage, come here. Follow me. You're just not gonna follow me, are you? You really are the mascot for the series, because nobody on this channel follows me. Heh. <laughs> okay. Um. Wait. Can I send out multiple Pokemon? I can! Look at them! They're. They're gonna play together. Come here, Trico. Play with your new friend. Daddy. See, he follows me. Trico loves me. Why are they both so small? Hold on. Daddy. Summary. Growth small. Yeah, that's not nice. And growth is ordinary. So I guess he's just a small Pokemon. He's good, actually. He has a high special attack, so that's a nice nature for him. Nice. Okay, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode, like I actually said before, but yeah. See you all later. I'm gonna go put away all this stuff in my inventory. Goodbye! Oh yeah, also, if we press I, we can open the Pokedex, which is pretty cool. Wait. Oh, we're pressing I with the thing in our hand. Hold on. Empty hand and press I. Yeah, look! We For some reason, we have Bulbasaur, but if we scroll... You can see we have Trico, and it'll give us a little thing about that. And we have Starmie, too. Where are you, Starmie? Starmie? Starly. Star okay, I guess Starly's not in here. Anyways, guys. Uh, we're gonna say bye, right, Trico? Wrong Pokemon, but I'll take it. Bye, everyone. So, uh, I went and bought two more Pokeballs from the Pokemart because I found a Chimchar and I really wanted to catch it, but I could not catch it because it ran away from me even though I put it in a little wooden box. But I just casually threw a freaking Pokeball at a Pidgeotto, or it was a Great Ball because I thought I might be able to catch it, and I did. What is this game? What is my life? Let's see. Summary. Oh my gosh, look at this. Uh, Twister, Whirlwind, uh, Quick Attack, and Gust. That is... He's a level 22. Wait a minute! What? Why? What? Hold on! Can somebody please explain to me why there's a level 48 Charizard? Charizard. Just casually chilling over here. This game, man. This game. Oh, hey. So, I guess we would want to train Shreko. Oh, well, okay. Um. Now we just go ahead and go like this. Pajato! Pajato! And Gust. Oh, flying is not very effective. Dragon. Oh, that was pretty good. More twister. Quick attack. Whoosh. Nice. Uh, Treko gained a lot of XP and he leveled up. Okay, I'm going to stop playing on this now because I don't want to get too far ahead of everybody. I promise. Bye.